Introducing the African Diaspora News Channel app, your gateway to stories that's overlooked by the corporate mainstream media. At African Diaspora News Channel, we cover stories that don't receive mainstream attention, and we serve as the voice to the global black community. We are committed to informing and educating through the power of media, connecting the African diaspora one story at a time. With our platform, we're helping to end injustice by exposing it. Join us in standing for excellence in journalism and serving our community. Download the African Diaspora News app today. This is Victor John reporting for the African Diaspora News channel, reporting from Nigeria. All right, the news coming out of Africa in recent days are mind-blowing and i'm just this things give me joy presently officials of the national agency for science and engineering infrastructure in nigeria naseni have said that nigeria will soon fly the nation's aircraft as engineering work on the first made in nigeria helicopter is nearing completion <laughs> so the agency added that the helicopter will be a wholly made nigerian chopper and the project's manager um, disclosed this during a focus group engagement in Kaduna, Nigeria. So um, now the news, this particular news that a made in Nigerian chopper is set to fly soon is a game changer for both Nigeria and Africa. And this is why. Number one, for decades, Africa has depended or depended on foreign nations for aerospace technology, if you recall. Now if Nigeria successfully produces this helicopter, it's going to signal that Africa is moving beyond just being a consumer to becoming a producer of advanced technology, which could, of course, inspire other African nations to invest in aerospace research and development. Number two, manufacturing helicopters locally would mean that uh, would mean less reliance on costly imports and more opportunities for local communities. So there's going to be job creations, right? It's going to create thousands of jobs in, in engineering and aviation and manufacturing. This is going to stimulate economic growth, right? So if Nigeria scales up production, we could even begin to export aircraft to other African countries. I mean, I see that. I foresee that that's happening already in Africa. So um, if it's not, you know, frustrated, right? So number three, most African nations import military aircraft for defense and surveillance. So locally made helicopter means that Nigeria can improve its military and security agencies with homegrown technology, which reduce dependence on Western supplies. Other African nations might turn to Nigeria instead of Europe or US, you know, for the future. Number four, this particular project places Nigeria on the aerospace map. So if successful, it's going to pave the way for future innovation for locally made drones, you know, passenger aircrafts and space technologies, right? Which will bring Nigeria closer to countries like South Africa and Egypt in Africa, which already have stronger aerospace industries, right? So, I mean, what's your take on this? This is a brilliant idea if you ask me. This is something I love to hear. I love to see African trend, African progress. I love to see Africa win. With a helicopter, a chopper? Come on now. But the question is, who is going to be the first to get into that helicopter? I hope somebody will be confident enough to get into it. Anyways, yeah, that's on the lighter note. Uh, what's your take on this particular issue? What do you think? This is Victor Ojo reporting for the African Diaspora News Channel. Let me know what you think in the comment section.